credentials into the plugin uh, you can log in so this is a on this bubble app there's a one-click login which does these two steps uh, there's three steps it, but what you're doing is with one-click login you're doing three steps to authenticate to the Bullhorn API this has a you know this app has a nice little floating thing to tell you how long a session is session can be any length um, if you look and see how that works first thing we do is we chain together these uh, two steps so the first step is uh, get a north token the next step is to log in so it takes the auth token from the first step and we set a session time to live of 10 minutes and now we're logged in and all the rest of this is purely to do with managing those credentials so what this particular app does is it sets the bullhorn rest token and the rest url onto the ui in a, in a real app you wouldn't set these on the ui you would put them into the database so that they were um, secret with the right with privacy rules so that no one could read them and you would manage your these secret things through the database but for the sake of illustration I'm just setting them on a state which just to reiterate is not good practice you should stick them in the database because these are secret